Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the next episode of Luigi's Mansion. Last time, we conquered more of Area 3. And we got to see a really cool room. This time... Oh, I'm just going to keep going. I mean, what can truly stop us at this point, you know? Like, honestly, what could truly stop us? Probably the ghosts. But we're just going to, like, not... We're just going to not tell them that. Because then they might believe it. So, here we're going to do. We're going to get this ice. And last episode, I kind of, you know, hinted at it. <clears throat> just brushed it off, but... If, you, if I recall, there was a lovely lady in the, in the shower over here. Luigi's that kind of person now. Luigi's decided to, to eyes emoji the beautiful lady in the shower. Oh my god! A choo! Yes, yeah, so now she's cold. And that's about it. Now, she might give me a bit of a fight. Yeah, this is another one of those ghosts that's kind of just, you know. I'm going to make your life hard and difficult. And my thumb slipped off the joystick, so that didn't help either. But it's fine. We silvered it. We're at that point, guys. The game's getting harder. I mean, you might have noticed. I ain't get. Please. Thank you. All right. I ain't. I ain't catching ghosts as easily anymore. It's. It's, it's definitely become more and more difficult. Area one and two's gold streak is. It was just. It's just not enough. Alright. Now then. Now that we've done all that we could here, we can finally move on back <laughs> to Area 1 and 2. That's right. We're not doing Area 3 anymore. We, we, we've officially given up, as I would say. I gave up. We're leaving now. And, uh... Going back, we're gonna go back to area two. And I believe we got a key for this door over here. This door is indefinitely, indeed, not fake. Even though you could probably trick yourself into thinking it is fake, even though it isn't. Now, if I'm correct, I probably. There you are. You s yeah, that actually scared me. I I, I second guessed myself so much that when he actually appeared, it. Legit scared me. And Luigi's the Mansion isn't that kind of game that it's like you know, oh, I'm scared you. You know, it's like it, it's a, it's a Nintendo game. It's not supposed to scare you. You know what I'm saying? It just happens. You know. Give me my ball back. All right. Are you like? No, no. Okay. So he's gonna. So I mean, I've already been doing it, but the way you fight this guy, he shoots. You just take one of the balls, and you you just you, you you shoot him, and now 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 he's now he's dead. The billiards room, am I right? Whoa, whoa, he's he's really whoa, whoa. Come on, I've been failing. No, you asshole! He was one health away from just giving it to me. Ah, uh, you, you prick! Ah, oh, I was so. Cl I've been just taking L's in Area Three. Like I knew it was gonna happen, but God damn, I've been taking L's in Area Three. Just get in the vacuum. We're done. And that was yet another optional room. I, yeah, Luigi. Give me the money. Giving us our what is that? Third diamond. Which diamond? Their diamonds are really good. The diamonds are um. They're definitely, the, I believe, the second most money. I think so. Boo hoo! And we're back in area two, so his health isn't as big. That's another thing to note. Boos don't have their health by how far you're in the game. They have their health by what area you're in. So a boo in area one would have less health 
Because we went back to area two, which was this floor, so the booze had less health. That's kind of just how it works. Uh, now this room. This room is not optional. Just gotta start the projecting. Huh. It's kind of weird. There's nothing. Whoa. Guys, I think I found the movie. It's a ghost! Ain't no problem for the ghost king. Yeah, that's how you spawn. Nothing you could have done. You lost. Look at Ghost, being invisible, how they actually should be. Oh, there's two of them. How could I have been so fooled? I gotcha. I gotcha. You lost. Shake my hand. I, I apparently they haven't lost yet. Alright. Now, I could try to get them both at the same time. That isn't much of an effective strategy at actually taking out these guys. Because they will gang up on you. They have no problem doing so. Although, there are there sure are a lot of them. Alright, there we go. Oh, red chest. That's new. I don't think we see many of those around here. It might be because... It's... Mario's glove. It's a little sweaty. Mario. And I have to assume, like, wearing gloves, like, just everywhere, like, that has to... I... What? What? But that has to get really sweaty. And I have to assume that's really annoying. Shambu! Get in the vacuum cleaner. Only one booze. 21. Hmm. I don't like this projector. I'm getting rid of it. Give me. I'm taking it. You can't stop me. Hello? Give me my projector. Give me. Give me the projector. Whoa! Get out of here. Yeah, there's a couple of those posters around here that just, like, you know, you pull on it. And some of them damage you, though, so, yeah. I decided to demonstrate it on the one that wouldn't kill me. So, I believe we need one more item from Mario. I wonder what it could be. Who knows? He's just a big old smile on his face. Mario. So, I don't know why he still calls for Mario. He knows where he is. I don't know why he just expects Mario to just suddenly appear. Like, oh, I called for Mario. There he is. I've done it. Look at me. Luigi. Being good at the game. Mm -hmm. Anyways, so as, as we're walking in here, we're back in area one. For this door. Right here. I don't think we have anything else to do, right? Yeah, I, I, we're, all, we're all good down. Area two is done. Well, in a way. Area 2 is done. Area, and then this area, Area 3, there is what looks like one locked door. Although, there seems to be uh, a little bit of uh, awkward space here. No no door. Hmm. Guess I'll have to figure that out later. Hmm. Huh, weird room. Oh, what's in this bed? I won't worry about it. Whoa. Anyways. You're just gonna put all your money on the bed, huh? So, nice twin bed up here. Hmm. Pretty empty room, if I must say so myself. Got a heart in it. A nice chandelier with money in it. And, uh, little thing here. I guess we'll just start spinning then, huh? Oh, it's them! It's the twin! Guys! Guys, I, I got Spirit Box freezing and <laughs> EMF! It's the twins! 
Hey, why don't you play hide and seek with us? Ha 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 ha. Goodbye. <laughs> okay, let's play. Uh, we're gonna hide. I have to wait outside. Now then. Are we coming? There are boxes now. We have to find out. Now, here's the thing. This box isn't shaking. This box isn't shaking. This box is shaking. Same with this. But the others don't shake. How curious. It's almost like... The other boxes aren't real. The only ones they're hiding in are. Pretty... Now that obviously they're gonna call I mean, I did cheat. I did. But, I mean, that is a good way of finding out where they are. Now, this boss... Is very difficult. We're gonna get the guy in the car first, though. Okay, well, I, I mean, I say that, but... Um, obviously I didn't. Um, and... In terms of which one's more annoying, I would have to say, maybe the car. But you want to get him first anyway. And I'll, and I'll tell you why. I mean, you could probably, you probably have already noticed what I'm talking about. Why you want to get the car first. So, I'm getting the car first, and you might be noticing something. He didn't drop pearls. That's because the area ghost, this the, the, this portrait ghost, only the, the flight twin, I believe, is the one that drops pearls. Now, I could be wrong. It could be just the second twin you get is the only one that drops pearls. You fucker. God damn it. I'm trying to do commentary and shit. And I'm, I'm losing focus. I'm trying to be good at the game at the same time. But yeah. The second ghost, or the... I believe it's just the plain ghost, is the one that gives the pearls. So the idea is to save that ghost for last, so you have an easier time getting the pearls. Um, there, it is not... This is not the... I hate it here. This is not the first ghost... Well, no, this is the first ghost that's on that, but it's not the last ghost. Now this boo, the, he ain't running. There, There is no shot he's escaping. All of these rooms are lit. Area, This area is like... Well, I guess actually it's not done, but it's close. And that concluded the twins. And... We got Mario's shoe. And that... Is it? That's all five of Mario's items. Now you might be wondering... What do we do with those items? Hmm? What do we do with those items? It's a very curious... Curious thing, huh? What do we do with these items? Hmm. I think that question will be best answered... In the next episode... Of Luigi's Mansion. I'm just kidding. We're gonna do it. You bring up to this lady. That's not worthy. That's not cliffhanger worthy. I'm not gonna deceive you guys. Now, this will be a longer episode though, because I am gonna do this ghost in this episode. And the bit with this ghost is, she. I'm gonna mash. I'm just letting you know. I'm mashing through this. I'm gonna be talking. You can like pause and read, but she is going to tell me a fortune for all five of these items. And I'm going to have to talk to her and have these long-ass lines of dialogue for all five of these items. And yes, that's very annoying. So I'm just going to mash through it. I'm going to be talking with you guys. Um, so this, this ghost, obviously, she's telling her fortunes. And I get the idea, right? The idea is supposed to be foreshadowing to stuff that's going to happen later in the game and just where Mario is, right? But the thing is with most of these items is the foreshadowing is ruined because you get some of these items after you find out where Mario is, right? So it's the whole... It... It's... Yeah. Um, but 
the rest you can kind of if you're reading it which I mean I don't recommend it uh, it just foreshadows the final boss of the game essentially um, and it just, it just foreshadows towards the end uh, but re it really it's not worth th th this is the talking ghost uh, I'm just gonna I what, what is this I'm a Mario star all right I think is this is the third item Oh my god. And, uh. Oh my. Like, he really just. She just. Talks. And talks. And talks. And talks. And there's nothing you can do about it. You just have to sit here. And just. Read. All of this. And this. I mean, you guys have seen how much dialogue I've gone through by now. It literally, like, if I were to have, like, like I, I, and I assume, right, people watching this, if you're watching this, aren't gonna go, oh, boy, I, my favorite episode of Luigi's Mansion, the part where he read for 20 minutes, you know what I'm saying? Like, that, I'm just gonna just smash through it, it's, it, it's, it's not worth it. Alright, now, I can catch her. She finally said, alright, I'm done talking, I can rest in peace, and I can finally just catch her. Now this ghost, if I fail this ghost, I am going to be sad. This poison mushroom is going to be what does it, isn't it? Okay. Alright, I did it. I mean, I, I, I kind of figured I would, because that is one of the easiest ghosts in the game. Um, simply because she just decided, alright... I'm gonna be captured. Like I don't care. Like I've done. I've I've done what I wanted. She's the friendly ghost, right? Like she's okay with being captured. And now we can go upstairs. But first, we're gonna catch this ghost. Oh yeah. Is it in oh, yeah. here? Here. You're a boo ball. Are you in here? Booigi. It's him. It's Booigi! Bop. I've done it! I caught the boo. Now I'm at 24. No, 23 boos, actually. Interest. So. That will actually, though, be the conclusion for this part of Luigi's Mansion. Next time, I think... We might actually be able to complete Area 3. I think it's actually possible. Moving at a nice steady place into the game. Complete Area 3 and then get to Area 4 and then do all that. and Area 5, beat the game. And I hope you guys will enjoy it. But for now, I will see you probably tomorrow. Goodbye.